Hi, Air Signs, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. Welcome to my channel. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I really appreciate your love and support. In this reading, we are going to get you some important love messages. Please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it may not resonate with each and every one of you. Spirits and angels, please show me important love messages for Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius um, today. Strength in reverse at the bottom of the deck. Please bear in mind that roles can be reversed between you and the person whom you could be thinking about or dealing with. When I say someone or somebody, that means it could either be you or the person, okay? So we've got the five pentacles here. Someone could be feeling left out in the cold. This may be an indication of a separation as well for some of you. Four of cups because of some sort of dissatisfaction. And the chariot here is in reverse. Somebody put a stop to this connection thinking that it's going to be really tough. Okay. Because if you look at the five, uh, five of Pentacles, there's this uh, handicapped person here. So somebody may be feeling either they they are stringing, they're being, they are stringing, uh, they're being strung along, <laughs> or that um, being with this person is just going to make life really hard or really tough. Okay. You know, I always talk about how if you choose the wrong partner, it. It will not just bring you down emotionally, it will bring you down in many aspects in your life, including your work or your finances um, and other things, well-being. Um, hmm. So I feel like someone may be dissatisfied right now because they feel like I've been there for you, I've been there with you through ups and downs and uh, now this is what you do do or what you did to me i don't know what it is exactly we'll pull out more cards in a bit but at what i'm seeing here with the four of cups and a chariot here somebody has put a stop to this connection because they're dissatisfied in regards of the current situation some of you it may have something to do with money or that someone feeling like they're being abandoned uh, someone feeling like they're not being treated fairly or that it's just this energy where someone feels that, you know, I can get through, go through this, these hardships with you. I don't mind it, but I feel that right now I'm being underappreciated, okay? Again, it could be you or your person. Rose can be reversed. And we've got the temperance here, the queen of wands in reverse and the king of cups in reverse. The king and the queen are you know, the queen is queen of wands is fire and then the king is water. I feel like there needs to be a balance between you and somebody here. Uh, Spirit's definitely saying there needs to be a balance between two, uh, the two of you um, to make things work. Because it feels like the Queen of Wands is someone very different from the King of Cups. Maybe you and your person are just very different people, okay? And I feel like with the Queen of Wands and Wabras, this indicates somebody not wanting to pay attention to this person right now but focusing on their healing and recovery while one person here is feeling really uh, overwhelmed or unstable emotionally right now and maybe having a lot of uh, negative thoughts or unhappy uh, memories from the past and we've got the page of wands here and love first could be dealing with a fire sign aries sagittarius leo right so the page of wands and the queen these two again there could be an age gap between two of you or both of you just have just are very different hmm, from each other and two of cups and love first just not seeing eye to eye or not being on the same page uh, right now or it could indicate a separation between you two, or lack of communication, or lack of good, communi uh, good communication with the page of wands here in love first. There's this energy of somebody here feeling that, you know what, I don't think I want to return to this person. It has been really tough. Um, maybe needing time, because temperance indicates patience as well. Needing time to think um, and to gain some sort of balance and also wanting to make the right decision mm, 
the thing is i don't know why the temperance is an angel right someone may be feeling like i've been such an angel to you i've been so kind to you i've been so patient i've done this done that and then now feels like something has gone awry maybe both of you are separated to a cups and rubbers or not you know on the same page could also be because of third party for those of you if you do know you are in a third party situation the queen of wands and lovers could be the blockage right this could be that person whom could be uh, meddling into your connection right now could have caused this uh, separation or arguments or dissatisfaction for cups here hmm. Well, it could be you with someone else, you putting someone in a third party situation or your person putting you in a third party situation, either or. The strength card here is in reverse and we've got the star and the emperor in reverse. Hmm. I feel like someone is saying, I'm just gonna go with the flow because look at the water here. It feels like it's flowing, right? It looks like it's flowing. So that means to me, this indicates someone, someone could be feeling that I'm just going to go with the flow right now. I'm just going to um, take care of myself, go through healing and recovery and just let it be the strength in my verse. Just not wanting to deal with it right now. And the emperor in my verse, because someone may be feeling that right now, um, it is completely out of their control. Okay. Someone feels, again, this is completely out of my control. I need time to think, to heal, to regain my balance here before I take actions, before I decide what to do next, how to move forward. Again, it could be you or your person. Some of you, you're just celibate, yeah? Because the temperance and the star here just maintaining your celibacy or that you just don't want to be physically intimate with some just anybody i sense you're in this energy where you know even with the queen of wands here and lovers you're not looking for you know just passion desire chemistry i feel like a lot of that four of cups may have disappointed you or it may have come to a point where it's a boring okay i hope that makes sense to you it comes to a point where it is boring and it is time for you to make some changes here uh to renew the star to me is a renew renewal energy as well it could be you know going through some sort of renewal the temperance here you may have become more spiritual or more religious and just putting aside i feel like um relationships or just anything that is not long lasting because six of cups here is a lovers and also again we've got the king of cups and lovers you may have been dealing with people who may be emotionally unavailable or emotionally unstable or could have put you in a third party situation you know um all of that i feel like it has taken a toll on you with the five of pentacles here so we've got the ten of pentacles in love first king of Pen oh, sorry nine of pentacles and the will of fortune in love first so there is a stuck energy there is someone here too that i'm sensing they could be seeing you watching you as somebody they've always been wishing for or that they would like to make peace with you right offer you commitment with the nine of pentacles you'll offer you an apology here ten of pentacles here is in my verse perhaps you were in a relationship with this person serious relationship or some of you could have been married to this person whatever the case is it's in my verse so something may have happened right um maybe it has something to do for some of you it could be financial issues or commitment issues or just differences not seeing eye to eye um, being on a not on the same page and someone here with a world of fortune does not want this to end right um someone would like to stick around that's what i'm getting here but it's moving to super slowly because of the knight of pentacles here someone could also be promising will, or will be promising that they are committed or that they will work really hard on this connection or work really hard at work okay especially if there's uh some financial issues because the five pentacles i read it also as a bankruptcy card right that's not for all of you some of you maybe there's some uh financial issues as well somebody could be going through it right now mm, it feels like more like a team kind of thing like a teamwork as in maybe one person makes more money than the other or both are jobless i mean something that's going on financially okay between the two of you here that's for i think maybe 20 percent of you not all of you okay um hmm 
you know, I always talk about, again, you know, how if you choose the right partner. For me, getting into a relationship, I spend a lot of money. <laughs> because when you're in a relationship, uh, you spend money on um, entertaining uh, your person, you know, just going out together, watching a movie, eating, buying presents, all of these things, it just takes money. And sometimes if your person isn't doing well financially, they may borrow money from you, right? Or take money from you. So uh, some of you, maybe this is what's going on right now. So, and I feel like someone may be feeling too burdensome, all that feeling underappreciated. And right now just doesn't want to deal with the situation right now, or that it could have um, turned into you know, this separation here with the two of cups in love first. Someone may also be sent feeling that me and this person are just not on the same level. Uh, sometimes it could indicate somebody outgrowing someone as well with the four of cups because uh, I believe that every 10 years we change. You know, uh, when I was um, in my teens, I thought I wanted this and, you know, 10 years later I changed. Even food i changed my taste in food i changed my taste in uh, colors decoration all kinds of things it, it, it just keep changing right i feel like some of you it could be somebody here just outgrowing someone because they feel like this person is just you know dragging along or just sitting or riding on their coattail while they are you know they try to move forward uh, but someone is just pulling them down or holding them back okay that's what i'm getting here that's for some of you and six of wands in lovers page of swords and we've got the nine of cups in lovers i see somebody is very unhappy right because the other person could be doing better or could be doing well right now and someone is just holding i'm sensing these grudges here a bit of a grudge saying if i'm not with you i could have I could have done better, you know, because sometimes in relationships, some people, um, they sacrifice. They sacrifice where they're living or they sacrifice their job. They sacrifice whatever it is so that, you know, both of them can be together. So some of you, it may have something to do with that. But the page of swords here for me indicates somebody could be spying on you or vice versa, right? Feeling really unhappy because maybe you're not paying them attention, six or ones in love first, and you're just focusing on yourself right now. But this person is coming in, it feels like, um, but very slowly coming in and wanting to apologize or heal this connection. All right, air signs, Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius. This is your reading. I hope you resonated. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm going to leave you with my latest video on the screen right now. This video is from my second channel. It's a travel vlog channel. If you're interested, check it out. And also, I'll leave you with a playlist on the screen. It says bonus compilation reading. You can just click on it, scroll all the way down, look for your sign. There could be some other important messages over there for you that you may have missed. As you guys know, I post your videos almost every single day. So these readings are still valid, okay? And also, I'm open for personal readings. If you like the book, me my information is in the description box below take care bye